Hey there, and welcome back to our channel. Today's a very special day because we're taking a trip down memory lane and revisiting the beloved K-pop group Sistar. This four-member girl group disbanded due to a unique pact. If one member of Sistar wanted to leave, they all agreed to disband. This decision reflected their strong bonds and mutual respect. However, after pursuing solo careers, fate brought two members, Bora and Hyolin, back together. Now, after 11 years, they've made a comeback as the duo Sistar 19, the same duo that created bangers like like my boy and got around not any longer. Now before we jump into the details, remember to click that subscribe button to keep up with all our future updates regarding the world of K-pop. Before we go any deeper into the Sistar 19's comeback, let's learn briefly about the group and their individual journeys in the K-pop universe. Sistar was a popular K-pop girl group that debuted in 2010 under Starship Entertainment. The group consisted of four talented members, Hyolin, Bora, Soyu, and Dasum. They quickly gained attention for their catchy songs, impressive vocals, and energetic performances. As a group, Sistar achieved remarkable success with hit songs like So Cool and Alone. They were known for their summery vibes, captivating choreography, and the powerful vocals of their lead singer Hyolin. Sistar became a household name in the K-pop scene, winning numerous awards like Melon, Golden Disc, Soul Music, and Mnet Asian Music Awards. However, one of the songs that did exceptionally well was Touch My Body that was released in 2014. The track dominated South Korean music charts, securing the top spot on Gaon Digital Chart and Melon. Boasting over 2.5 million downloads, Touch My Body earned platinum certification from the Korea Music Content Association, or KMCA. The accompanying music video garnered millions of views on YouTube, underscoring its international appeal. Beyond chart success, the song clinched the Best Dance Performance Female Group Award at the 2014 Mnet Asian Music Awards, or MAMA. In 2017, Sistar made the heartfelt decision to disband, keeping a promise they had made to each other. They decided that if one member wanted to pursue individual paths, the entire group would gracefully part ways. After Sistar disbanded in 2017, So Yu went solo. She continued making music on her own and worked with different artists. You might have heard her sweet voice in popular songs like Some and Gotta Go. So Yu also showed up on TV shows, letting everyone see her fun side. Basically, she didn't stop rocking the music scene even after Sistar, and fans still loved her for her awesome solo journey. Moving on to Dasum, who pursued a career in acting, she transitioned to the world of television and film and proved her love for acting in various dramas and movies. Dasum made her acting debut in the drama Love Revolution and went on to star in other projects such as Band of Sisters, He is Psychomatic, and Uni is alive. Through her roles, Dasum demonstrated her versatility as an actress and gained recognition for her performances. Despite the disbandment, the members continued their careers in various fields, with Hyolin and Bora eventually reuniting as a duo called Sistar 19. Fast forward to 2024, after an 11-year hiatus, Sistar 19 made a comeback and finally on November 17th, it was officially announced that Sistar 19 is making a comeback in January after 11 years. As I've said before, the duo's journey began with the hit My Boy in 2011 and continued with the 2013 single Gone Not Around Any Longer. What's really exciting is that now, they're bringing us No More, a sequel to My Boy. Hyland shared that My Boy was about the joy of young love, while Gone Not Around Any Longer explored the pain of a breakup. In one of the interviews, Bora expressed her emotions on the Sistar 19 comeback. She revealed that the idea initially wasn't something they took too seriously. It was more of a casual conversation about the possibility of reuniting when the time felt right. Bora shared her long-standing desire to return to the stage after dedicating seven years to her acting career. Despite this desire, she faced challenges finding the right opportunity and lacked the courage to sing again. However, with the support and encouragement from Hyolin, Bora feels grateful to be back on stage, stating that her courage has been restored. We weren't completely serious when we first started talking about coming back as Sistar 19. It was more along the line of, we should reunite when we can, Bora said. I've always wanted to be back on stage, as I focused on my acting career for the last seven years, but I couldn't find the opportunity, nor did I have the courage to sing again. Thanks to Hyland, I'm back on stage, back with my courage. Sistar19 also shared that their focus is not winning trophies, but they hope to become a driving force for them as well as their fans. They want to inspire other idols who are afraid of starting their solo careers while thinking that they've gotten old and wrinkly. Instead of winning trophies or whatever, I just hope 
this comeback acts as a driving force for both of us as we continue with our separate solo activities," Hyalin added. Of course, we would like it if the song is received well, but it's not like we can choose that. I hope we can be the cool Uni and Nuna, not just because we've been here for so long, but because we matured over the years and that shows. Bora said. Uni and Nuna, Korean terms for elder sister, are used colloquially to call older females in a friendly way. In conclusion, Sistar 19's comeback brings back so many memories. With its connection to previous song My Boy, No More My Boy, only makes things much more interesting. What do you guys think about Sistar 19's brand new surprise for K-pop fans? Let us hear your thoughts on Sistar's comeback in the comments down below.